Solar maximum nears. Scientists face seven-month wait to confirm activity peak. The sun's cycle of increased activity presents challenges in timely recognition. The solar maximum, the peak of the sun's approximately 11-year cycle of heightened activity, is looming on the horizon. However, pinning down the exact timing of this event poses a unique challenge for scientists, as the confirmation may not come until seven months after the event has concluded. As the sun gradually intensifies its activity, scientists closely monitor sunspots, visible indicators of the sun's magnetic field, in order to identify the occurrence of solar maximum. This critical phase in the solar cycle remains uncertain until at least seven months after its conclusion, leaving researchers curious about the delayed confirmation. The European Space Agency's Space Weather Coordination Center's Solar Expert Center sheds light on the intricate process. Solar experts utilize a 13-month smoothed sunspot number convention, considering the values six months before and after a given month. This means that the exact value for a specific time is only known six months later. To definitively declare the occurrence of solar maximum in a particular month, scientists must observe a decline in sunspot numbers the following month. In practical terms, if solar maximum happened in February 2024, scientists would require sunspot data from the preceding six months, February 2024 itself, and the subsequent six months, extending the confirmation period to September 2024. Europe Space Agency's solar scientists caution that appearances can be deceiving, as increased activity might be a localized peak, not representative of the entire cycle. The concept of a double maxima, known as Gneveshev's gap, introduces the possibility that the initial peak may not be the highest, with another significant peak following. This complexity in solar cycle dynamics means a considerable waiting period before confirming Solar Cycle 25's solar maximum. Predictions from the World Data Center for Sunspot Index and long-term solar observations at the Royal Observatory of Belgium suggest a maximum between mid-2024 and end of 2025. In parallel, the Space Weather Prediction Center at NOAA estimates a solar maximum window from late 2024 to early 2026, emphasizing the uncertainty surrounding the precise timing of this event. Safety Precautions Amidst Scientific Challenges Navigating the risks of increased solar activity in a time of delayed confirmation. As the solar maximum approaches, Ushering in the peak of the sun's 11-year cycle of heightened activity, scientists grapple with the unique challenge of confirming this event, a process that might take up to seven months after its conclusion. While the scientific community navigates this delay, understanding and implementing safety precautions become paramount. Monitoring sunspots and magnetic field activity. As the sun gradually intensifies its activity, scientists closely monitor sunspots, visible indicators of the sun's magnetic field. This critical phase in the solar cycle, known as solar maximum, remains uncertain until at least seven months after its conclusion. In the interim, heightened vigilance is required in monitoring sunspot patterns and magnetic field fluctuations. The European Space Agency's Space Weather Coordination Center's Solar Expert Center plays a crucial role in shedding light on the intricate process of solar monitoring. Scientists employ a 13-month smoothed sunspot number convention, considering values six months before and after a given month. This complex methodology means that the exact value for a specific time is only known six months later, emphasizing the need for continuous observation and analysis, definitive confirmation and safety measures. In practical terms, if solar maximum occurred in February 2024, scientists would require sunspot data from the preceding six months, February 2024 itself, and the subsequent six months, extending the confirmation period to September 2024. During this time, it is crucial to prioritize safety measures, especially for activities and technologies sensitive to solar fluctuations. Caution against deceptive appearances. 
ESA's solar scientists caution that increased activity might be a localized peak, not representative of the entire solar cycle. The concept of a double maxima, known as Gneveshev's gap, introduces the possibility that the initial peak may not be the highest, with another significant peak following. This underscores the importance of exercising caution and implementing safety measures even when preliminary indications of solar maximum are observed. Uncertainty and preparedness. The complexity in solar cycle dynamics means a considerable waiting period before confirming solar cycle 25's solar maximum. Predictions from the World Data Center for the Sunspot Index and long-term solar observations at the Royal Observatory of Belgium suggest a maximum between mid-2024 and the end of 2025. Meanwhile, the Space Weather Prediction Center at NOAA estimates a solar maximum window from late 2024 to early 2026.